So what I find key to these cells, and this cell right here is copper and copper. Both electrodes are copper. And this is Elmer's glue and salt. So what I find key to these cells working as good as they do is adding salt to them. And I think the main ingredient, because this is um, edible salt, this is what humans would eat. And what they add to the salt for preservatives is uh, basically a, t a type of sand, sodium something something, I can't remember off the top of my head, but that's important. There's, that, there's a type of sand, this, it's a crystal, it's a um, quartz crystal, that's what it is. And that's what gives these cells really are able to sing, it's that quartz. And adding salts to these cells really does make it sing very well. As you can see, we're holding pretty steady on that. And it's actually going up. So, very interesting effect. Uh, the key to this cells are these glue batteries and um, sand metal cells is uh, adding quartz to the mixture, which is basically salt. Um, yeah, the quartz is the key. And I think, um, we'll elaborate a little bit more. Um, I think the reason, why, I think uh, they call us petrovoltaics. And I think petrovoltaics is the same thing as piezoelectrics. Um, but petrovoltaics is getting its vibrations from the uh, gravity waves. And that's what's giving you constant power. Things like crystals or quartz are detectable by the gravity waves. And they give out constant energy. So all these cells are being powered by gravity and that's my thinking on the situation as you see it's a constant output power so yeah it's the quartz that makes these things really what they are